I'm Patricia McNeely. I'm a Blu-ray Twin Flame from Chicago, Illinois. And this is a wonderful thing that I love to present to you of a beautiful couple and them telling their own story with some of my help to be able to come together and they share their beautiful love story that's been going on for a couple of years and is all coming together so beautifully. They let me use some photos and I want them to tell you in their own way. So sit tight and just watch a beautiful love story. The love story with a brand new beginning because love has more ways than the mind knows. This is Anthony and he found his love Debelina over a great distance. Their story is kind of magical and let me introduce his love. This is Debelina. They met in the United States, yet they lived a world apart. So this is also a tale of two lovers and two cities. They wished to make it happen. He longed to just see her again and again, and he made it happen. But let's rewind. How did they do this? Hi, it's Patricia, and I'm here with Anthony and Debelina. And I... Uh... They recently celebrated their one year anniversary. And uh, maybe you guys could talk a little bit about how you met. Sure. Um, so we met um, six years ago um, in Virginia. We were at a place called Rebirthing mm -hmm. International. And um, we were practicing a um, Rebirthing practice. Rebirthing practice. Yeah. It's a, a breathing technique essentially for relaxation. And um, essentially I was there to learn more about it. And I was doing some teaching there. And uh, Devalina. So I uh, got to know about rebirthing from India. And um, it interested me. So I planned my travel and I went to Virginia. And that's how I met him. Mm -hmm. And he was my teacher. <laughs> <laughs> he was my breathwork teacher and um, I think in the very first uh, healing session that we had, things started like unfolding mm -hmm. in a very deep way. Um, so I think, yes, at, at the energy level, he was able to bring up some very deep stuff about me and I was just blown away by that. And that's how our interaction began. And then I think within a week or so, we became very good friends. And it felt like we knew each other for a very, very long time. Mm -hmm. We felt that that level of familiarity and um, you, know, you just could be yourself is something I've never felt before. And I think that was the seed to you know, the journey that we have had from then till now. I, I think that you know when we were when we were there, it was also kind of magical in a way um, yes. because our you know we we both felt that things that were going on at, at the place that we were at uh, were not going very well, and we decided to leave um, you know together um, earlier than expected, and you know it was the beginning of her vacation. And we decided to, you know, travel together and really um, just kind of get to know each other. And you know, we ended up going back to my hometown and spending uh, about two months together, I yeah, believe. Yeah, yeah. Almost two months together. And um, after that, we you know, kept the relationship up, you know, over, over Skype. Skype for, I don't think we saw yeah. each other for what, like two years? Two years. And two and a half years. Yeah, two and a half years. It was yeah. a long time. It was a yeah. long time. And, and there <laughs> was a lot time, long distance. <laughs> yes. Yeah. And there was a lot going on back home after I came back to India. A lot of challenges that I had to go through, you know, to be able to stand up for myself and, you know, acknowledge the relationship that we've had. Um, yes. Yeah, and I feel like, you know, us being together there were you know there were other people involved in this a little bit and it's like they all in their own way were like a catalyst um for for us to be together and you know i mean some of it were they they were not helpful i mean they, they were helpful for us to be together but they were not very nice about it essentially but it's it was a 
it was it was like the universe was kind of unfolding for us. Um, and I think the best part about our relationship was as if the trust, the faith, was yeah. so easy. Right. You know, very easy. Uh, there have been times when we would have a lot of arguments over Skype, you know, just general fights, and I would think to myself, oh, probably it's time that he's just going to let me go, or I'm going to let him go. But that never happened. That never happened. Like, yeah. it was like, uh, I would say, things were never really favorable. And I would often wonder, is this going to be possible? Is this really going to be possible that I'm going to have a relationship with him and eventually get married down the line? Mm -hmm. Like, my family agreeing to accept him and his family agreeing to accept me that was, I felt there could be challenges because we come from two different countries, totally different cultures, yet there were so many common things about us. I think that was working in favor of us. And everything, you know, about our wedding happened so smooth. That was really nice. Yeah. And, I, and I'm very happy how my family has been able to accept him and how easy it has been for him to gel with all my family members and how his family accepts me. Yeah, yeah and even, beautiful. The way, even the way that the wedding came about was was pretty interesting too because yeah. we were originally were planning on doing uh, the fiance visa so that she could come here and we would get married here. Like um, you mean in the US? Yeah, in the, in the US. And um, yeah. He was coming to see me in December, right? Mm -hmm. 2017 no 2018 2018 and so it was just going to be like a regular visit yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then uh, we never knew that we were going to get married it just got planned in a very short amount of time mm -hmm. yeah and i think meanwhile uh, i think the last year the, the year prior i was traveling to the u.s to see him and um, um, I was basically sent back home uh, because one of my tickets were, air tickets were not in place. I was sent back home and, and I wasn't able to you know, go see him. And it wasn't really possible for us to go fly to another country because of a bunch of constraints. So I mean, the only option that was open was for him to fly out to India and see me. Yeah, and this has been my this is my fourth trip to India now, and in, in two years. Um, wow! Yeah, it's it's been. I mean, I love coming here, but it's a really long flight. <laughs> <laughs> because where your heart is. Yeah, and and it makes it easier. You know, it it makes it easier. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's still hard. But but it's it's. So it's really I would cool. I would say that. Uh, the relationship since 2014 up until now, um, we get, we talk to each other like two times a day, every single day. Uh, and it feels very real, like very, very real. It's never felt that, I mean, yes, we miss each other, like physically being next to each other is what we miss, but our relationship has been so strong. Like when we fight, it feels like we are, you know, right next to each other and fighting, or when we express our emotions, it feels as real as being together. Yeah. So I think that way we we've, we've grown together as a very strong couple, and and I think there were so many challenges, you know, financial problems, and uh, me about to lose my apartment here in Bangalore. So many things happened, but we stayed strong, and I think, and I think, uh, we we are a great team together. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, I we're when you focus on your heart. Yeah, and I think above all, uh, we know who we are. We know that we are twin flames, but we are not very high on that 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 term twin flames. We Keep that aside and we both face life in a very practical way. It's not that if we are twin flames, everything is just going to 
happen for us, but we just have to be there and allow and, you know, life creates a way. Yeah, I, so, I, think, I think that we definitely have, like, the universe on our side when it comes to, you know, being together and things like that. I think that a lot of things have, like, really come together for us. And it's been really challenging, but like, like yeah. she was saying, it, it's, you know, it, it's been relatively easy. You know, it's just the, the the relationship part has been like really easy. The, the other stuff is the challenging stuff. It's like the real world stuff is the challenging yeah. part. Everything around you that tries to intrude. Right. Yeah. And, yeah. and there are also, uh, I would also like to add over here that it's not that he does not trigger me. It triggers me a lot. Okay. <laughs> Um, and at this stage of my life, being into, you know, the world of healing for quite some time, like, I try not to blame him for my experiences and take ownership of what I'm experiencing through him. I try that as much as possible. Yeah, I'm kind of yeah. annoying. I get it. <laughs> but cute annoying. Right. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. She- well, I think what's impressed me the most is, is it's, it's so, it's like almost beautifully simple. You just, you're in love and you want to be together. And yeah. love is what's carrying the day and dissolving the things and, you know, helping sort out the outer world so that the path, you know, has, um, you know, it's like taking that machete for you to clear, you know, something while you pause sometimes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hurdles for sure, but um, yeah, and definitely I also think smooth. that uh, fears and doubts they keep coming up, they keep coming up, and all we do is just okay, let's face it. Yeah, yeah. so mm-hmm. I think we have had a good share of experiencing all, all our fears, you know, coming out. Mm-hmm. Um, and maybe that's the way ahead. So, and what has kept us strong is our love for each other, and it has only grown stronger and deeper. Yeah, I mean, I I feel like the relationship has become a lot more mature. You know, in the beginning, it was it was very emotional, and now that we've like overcome some things, and you know, I think that it's it's been a really positive thing for us where I don't know. It just, it just feels just so natural and it always kind of did, but now it's like, it just, it just means so much. It's, I don't know. It's, it's, it's really, yeah, it's really, it's, it's very, it's a lot deeper than it used to be. And you know, it's, it's becoming just more enjoyable by the day. I mean, even with the arguments, you know, and they, you know, they do happen and, but for the most part, it's like... It's easy to deal with it now. Yeah, and it's like we... Yeah. I mean, we both know that this is not something we need to take seriously and, you know, uh, run, basically operate from our egos. That's what we never do. I mean, yeah. even if you do, that's very short-lived because I think it knocks some sense back into our way of thinking and that is where we, I think we both are quite mature this way yeah and you you find things sort of dissolve away a lot more rapidly yes mm-hmm. yes yeah. and i would say uh, <laughs> i would say i definitely uh, see a huge change in the way my relationship was in the initial times mm-hmm. and <laughs> i would say i would doubt him I felt that it was all me into this and, you know, it was all me into this and probably he is just, okay, fine. I have a girlfriend from, from some part of the world. He was very cool about everything and it took me a while to understand that he's really serious about this relationship. Oh, yes. He was very in love, still is. You both are. Yes, I, I totally agree that. I like. It's been our first wedding anniversary and he's been here for a week and I, I can sense a whole lot of change into like from being that lover 
to becoming the married man and yet being the same person. Yeah. Yeah, and it, you know, it's like, I, I knew that like, that the connection was like very real, like right from the start, um, you know, for a lot of reasons, but it's like, as, as time went by, it, you know, it's like, I knew that like, the only thing that could stop us was, was us really. Just if we just didn't have like the, the patience or, you know, the discipline to just, you know, make sure that we're, we're talking to each other, make sure that we're, we're doing these things. And, and I kind of felt like maybe we had to make sure that those things happened. And after all this time, it's like, it just happened so naturally. It just happened so easily. Uh, we always, you know, find time to talk to each other. Um, you know, it's not always at the best hours, given our time difference, but... Yeah, <laughs> especially when it is like 9.30 here and it's 11 o'clock there. Yeah, maintaining a good sleep schedule has been tough. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and, uh, and so I, so what I feel about our relationship, what makes me very proud of our relationship is that we are like a team. We have, it's, it's very natural how we have a set of goals and that those goals are very common. It's not something we've adjusted to each other. It's something that just falls in place. Mm -hmm. And we feel like we have a life that we so much want to create together. Mm -hmm. And it just, it's as if, you know, our goals, our dreams are just the same. Yeah. Like, yeah, like right from the start, it was like, that was like really apparent that, I mean, we, we both kind of wanted the same thing. Like, you know, we, we both had the, like the same idea of, you know, how we want to like finish our lives, essentially, where we want to be, what we want to be doing, you know? Yeah. And yeah. I think that we're both very supportive of each other of how to, how to get to oh, those he's places. Very supportive of me. I mean, he's been such a huge support, especially in challenging times. Uh, I am very grateful. Yes. Well, you two love each other. It's apparent you're beaming. Your rings are so shiny. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah. You can see. Beautiful. Well, it's always a pleasure to talk to both of you and thanks so much for sharing and taking some time with me to, you know, share and just update and um, let me know how, you know, how you were doing and getting through. And I feel very honored to know both of you, very privileged to, um, you know, just be around you and um, look forward to, you know, seeing you guys live and in person at some point. So thanks so much and uh, enjoy, just keep enjoying each other. Yeah. Thank, you. Thank you so much for being our mentor in the initial times of our relationship. Thank you so much for giving me the support to not give up and just stand by him when I most needed the support. Oh, you're so yeah. welcome. Thank you. Yeah, and the, and the work you do is, you know, as much as she says, I don't, I don't watch it. Like I do watch it sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. Okay. It but, actually but doesn't yeah. work that way, where you can send my videos to everyone. <laughs> if at least one, this is a beautiful part. Like sometimes I'm usually just it's one person. Yeah. I I, I really like the work that you do, and it's uh, it's been a it's been really helpful. So thank you very much. Oh, well, thank you, too. And have a wonderful rest of your time together. Things will definitely keep getting smoother and smoother. So thanks a lot. And uh, have fun. Enjoy. Thank you. thank you. We love it when people make it official. They even invited me to their wedding. I was so honored that they invited me, but I could not go right away. They had their wedding in India. They shared with me photos of their wedding ceremony, and I have their permission to show you. And here is Anthony, the proud groom, and here is the happy couple. They had a wonderful wedding with family and friends, and their wedding ceremony, they told me, was so much fun. 
Their parents were so happy and proud. They're two lovers that found each other again. And through twin flame reconnection and coaching and healing the blocks, which helped to remove the deep age old obstacles, stopping the tension between lovers and the triggers for reuniting. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope it inspired you to hear that people go through things and sometimes with just some work here and there, body work, working with the subtle bodies, huge things can actually take place and unfold to get you into your new life and the love you deserve. Be well and I will see you.